Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. In the first episode in phase three of the battle for Astrakhazu, I've decided to start a new playlist for this one, just because it's slightly different than the uh, the past two phases of the battle for Astrakhazu. This one's a larger battle against the Free Worlds League. So as you can see from the map here, we're part of Azraka province. Magashi province was our first enemy. Just north of us is the city of Shendi, who we did some work for in the second phase against the Red Reapers to the north in a valley. They were causing a lot of trouble up there, interfering with a lot of corporate interests for the city of Shendi. And now they've called on our aid once again. With the arrival of the Red Reapers and a variety of other pirate and mercenary units in system, the Free Worlds League became concerned as this is an independent planet on their border. They decided to send a detachment of units here to try and stabilize the planet. With the Red Reapers now gone and a lot of the other larger mercenary units in system dismantled, the Free Worlds League still hasn't left. And in fact, they've increased their numbers on the planet. Shandy's concern is valid as just east of them in a town of El Abaya, the Free Worlds League has established a large base. They brought in several mech battalions and a lot of conventional units to help defend their new position. This large presence on the planet has made a lot of the warlords on the surface nervous. They all like their independence and the last thing they want is for the Free Worlds League to try and claim the planet for themselves. The variety of warlords in the area and the city of Shendi have all come together to try and get a large enough unit to be able to remove the Free Worlds League from the surface. They've engaged us as sort of champions of the planet to help them in this process. So our planning has gone as follows. The largest units we have are from the city of Shendi and from Agashi province. The units from Shendi will approach El Abaya from the west and just before they reach the town they're going to head north. The units from Agashi province will flank along the east heading north in an attempt to combine with the forces from Shendi. The goal is to make it look like they're planning on attacking El Abaya from the north. In the south the Night Gaunts, the Dragon's Rejects, and our other units are approaching El Abaya through dry river valleys. The goal is to get close enough to be able to make a quick strike against the airfield they have set up there and hopefully force them to retreat off planet. So for this part of the Battle of Astrakhazi, we're going to focus mainly on our units in the south. We're just going to say that the units from Agashi Province and from the Free City of Shendi are doing their own thing up north trying to tie up the Free Worlds League. Now this closer map is actually quite large. This is a, the southernmost portion and this is our starting position. So at the beginning of each episode we're going to move forward and our units will be revealing the enemy on the map as we go. And depending on what we encounter, certain groups of my units will engage and I'll just record the combats for those. The first phase will generally be pretty quick as most likely the Free Worlds League's outer defenses are relatively weak. And then as we approach the city the combat's going to intensify. They do have an assault battalion on the planet, so there should be plenty of four and five skull missions coming up. And that's it. This first video was just basically a status report showing you where we're at now for the Battle of Astrakhazi. And episode two will be the actual first battle. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to leave this video here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And if you got any questions or comments, please drop them in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.